fly ground, alright? Or all these things, so these are going to help us to produce and to make something good. Uh, they are very simple and very short points. Use them not to your mind. First of all, there are only two or three. Let's make them four. First of all, identify your goals and know exactly what you want to have in your future. For example, I said, what I want to have, I want to be an English speaker. Now, what you're going to do is that. Think about being an English speaker. Think about how I can make it sense. And there is second point that we all miss. You know, every day and every night, we need to practice it in ourselves. We need to practice every day to make something better. What is that? We need to jot down, to write, and to know exactly the list of our things, the list of our needs, and the list of what we really hope to get in this morning. Because let's round the present as a profession and the international speaker, he said, if you don't know yourself what you are doing, it's tough, quarreling, it's not everything. Then he said, there should be personal centralization. You need to centralize yourself. Now, this is the physical power, what I'm saying about. The physical power is the center of the right now, for example. You are right now here in this place. You better have to start and center the physical self center. You center yourself right now here, what you're going to do. So you gotta know that the way is your point. Is it back? So you gotta turn back. If your goal is in front of you, you gotta go forward. If your goal is in the right hand, you gotta go. So what is it if it is up? You gotta climb up the mountain and stay up at the top over there. Don't ever get down. Then you gotta use your mental power. What is that? Your mental power, you have the list of good programs. You have the list of your goals and your and your hopes. The one you gotta start is about setting a very successful project. Let me give you a comparison. Yesterday we were speaking about uh, foreign labor in Sudan. Can we give chance to Chinese people, to Turkish people? Can we give chance to American people, to British people to come down and have the investment right now to them? Some of them they said yes, some of them they said no. I told them that let's have a comparison. Cartoon Central Bank says we have we want to give every person a chance to have a job. Now, Chinese investor and Chinese investor come down. The Chinese is this. I want us to have a company. My, many factors are so strong in Sudan. Chinese is this. I want us to have a whole company. I want us to have a company to produce uh, to buy, uh, to produce computers. The Chinese guy, he comes down and says, I want to make a show of computers. So, you have your mental. You need to think bigger. Set your high goals. First of all, have the list of your own goals and set them down right now. First thing. Secondly, this is the point. This is uh, the uh, the point that we all like it. The calendar. Keep the calendar in your hand. So you look at the time every day and every moment. What is the time right now? So here is the time. What are you doing right now in this day? Exactly the point. Somebody from the team where he was the first or not the first one said, forget the past. Ever. Now, conquer the present right now. Conquer the present means use it. And it starts to do your job, then rule over the future. Because tomorrow you gotta do a better job. Your aim is not. In addition to what inside the restaurant, he said, when you go to the restaurant, order the first you have met. And take the dessert first because you don't have guarantees to live after you have your main course. The second person who was speaking about this also is he told us that we all successful people. We all are good people. But what's wrong is that we don't know what what we what we're supposed to do to achieve all of these things. It's getting difficult for all of us ladies and gentlemen. It's getting hard for every person. But what I'm speaking about is to set your goal, identify. If you do not identify, identify your goal, then you got no goal actually. This should be identification. You better have to keep the time calendar. When you keep the time calendar, it's going to help you what? To know what you have achieved in the past time. What we have achieved in the past time, we did two different presentations. Now we make use of our time, the previous hour. Why you write what you have done is going to help you and give you encouraged and focused to think about what you're going to have the next hour. Now, what you're going to have in the next hour, 
it's going to be what you're really looking to get, ladies and gentlemen. The third point is that I, I, I think most of us, they just really make it. You need to call someone to your goal, with your idea. For example, this morning, uh, this morning, yeah, I don't know. Uh, uh, are you going to 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 to, to stop this policeman? Are you going to, uh, for example, to Kiada? Are you going to you know, Khartoum University? No, you need to ask someone. Hey, my friend, where I can have my national number this morning because I want to make it early. I gotta get back home. I got what to do. He gonna tell you, okay, you gonna go back to east, and then you ask, you turn left to right, you find somewhere call, to give us nothing, and then you ask, you make it. But if you did not ask anybody, you do not know how to do that. You need to close that person. Who is that person? Maybe it's your father, it's your mother, your friend, your sister, your girl, whatever it is you have. But this person is supposed not to be so far. The person that you close, the person that you always give sacred, the person that you feel is real near, the person that you feel is a part of your sentence. Because we have two kinds of people. One of them, Waiting you to be successful and he say congratulations. Waiting you to be as successful and then he say congratulations. The second person is the person who has a hand, he says when it happens. Who has a hand in your sector? What kind of this person? Two of them. Your friend, he says, he's just waiting for you. When you graduate, he comes to say, Congratulations, my friend. Somebody else helps you, assist you, push you and give you power. Those two kind of people are very important. You need to close one of them. What is the benefit of closing someone's your ideas and telling them what to do? This is going to give to be natural and to be direct, direct uh, source of empowerment, direct source of encouragement. And here it says we have some people that a lot of English uh, uh, speakers and many trainers that, that, that they say to us, it's tall. It's it. It's stop. What is going to stop? It stop for the negative people. Don't ever stay with them. What they gonna do? They are gonna smack on you down. They feel you. Now they won't have it. If you do that job, they're not gonna say, "Wow, congratulations, you did a great job." No, they're gonna say, "This is, this is Madura. This is not very good." They're gonna say, "This is not very good." Church. No, those people are not. And that's why also I advise the Muslim speaker and say. The people's opinion in you that doesn't have to become yeah. your reality. Some people's opinion in you that doesn't have to become your reality. And those people are natural enemies to your sector. Are very natural enemies that are connected to what you want to do in your future. That's not, it's not going to happen tomorrow. They want to drop black and they suck and they want to have everything out of your life. So here it is. The point is clear for every person. Remember, people you join, people you talk to, friends you go with, the way you get, the way you eat, the way you talk, the book you read, the magazine you read, the newspaper you read, the channel you watch, determine who you want to be. Determine what you're going to have. It doesn't it. Now, there's the first point we all make. One of us, I can say, not all. Because if you are not successful, if you are not good, you're not going to be right now here at a university. A university that graduated many good people. What is this point? This point is that believe, believe, believe in yourself, in your power, and how much you have to contribute. Because we have many things to do in our life. You know, a young man of 25 years old, he said, now I have done nothing in my future. I am not a very successful person at all. Because I am not graduated. I am not a college student, even I'm not a worker. He come down and he, he asked me a question, he said, Shokun, I went around the hand, I said, what are you going to have? He said to me, I, I left the school since I was 17 years old, after I was 24, and I can't be happy. So what am I supposed to do? All my friends are going to don't get that. Stop from working. I said, listen up, stop everything. The first time is not yours. The future time is not going to see. But what you have is the kind of time. What are you doing in this time? He said to me, what am I going to do? I told him that, please, check out. Can you bring out a paper? He said, yes, I can. Just tell what's going to be in the future. I want to get English speaker. Then come on now. Yeah, I'm an English speaker. Go and learn English. You can be an English speaker. You can be a presenter. 
And you can be a teacher. And right now the guy is teaching English in different places. Um, I just want to wrap up ladies and gentlemen. I want to wrap up and come to the conclusion of being a very a good and very successful person in a future. That remember, all the world, uh, I know uh, the, the number, the, the, the population of the world, but I can say all the world right now is competition to get success. Anybody here wants to get something? I'm quite sure. You are in the college right now. You are in this building. You have something to contribute. You have something to get. Who doesn't want to be a hero? Who doesn't want to be a hero? I think most people get that. Who want to be a hero? We all want to be heroes. So to be a hero, remember, you are born hero. But you need to practice heroically. <laughs> you need to practice heroically. You need to do the job that you can. What is that job? The job is it's like that. Imagine yourself in the desert. No wires. No trees to shed. Nothing to eat. Imagine yourself. No man, no woman. Guys, uh, how can you imagine this? In a desert. A very big desert, you know, what you only have, you only have what's been written in my briefcase, that's called Hope, H-O-P-A. You have only one thing, call it Hope. And let me give you a very small quote that's given by the current president of, of, of U.S. He called Barack Obama, he's a black guy and all. He said, Hope is not blind activism. Hope is not blind optimism and he wrote a book called The Audacity of Hope. Then when he was talking to the President, he said, John Kent told us about that hope. And John Kennedy told us about hope. Then he said that I am not speaking about blind optimism. I'm talking about something more substantial, important and essential, and that this is hope. And then he said, hope in the face of difficulty. Hope is the face of uncertainty, and then he says, the adversity of hope. This is the title of his second book. Let me tell you what the quote of hope given to us by all of Quran. Always our religion, our prophet teacher, by the way, our friend Salah he was the first human development trainer. He was the first person he started to, to train people about being good. He started to tell people about how to be a, 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 a lovely person, and how to be an accepted person, and how to do all of these things. And then the quote is here. That means, much you work, much you earn. You work a lot. You earn a lot. Thank you. And, but don't tell me that in our country, and down here, we, we, we work long hours, less payment. No, it's not long hours, less payment. No, you work long hours, maybe, maybe short plan, short term. Remember, Ms. Brown says, a staff job doesn't give you enough money. <laughs> Stop it right now. Remember that you have much time to do. Don't just laugh off. Don't waste your time to do something that's not good. Because all of these things are there. So why don't we, ladies and gentlemen, believe in our potential? Believe in our hope and in our in our power. Remember to use the two important tools of performance as physical power and mental capacity. Help us to do and to contribute much and more in our life. And for that reason, I believe no sensitive man, no lady can be kicked behind. What do I mean by kicked behind is to be not to be unsuccessful person. There is nothing called failure as they say, but there is uh, there is uh, repeated errors. You make errors today, you never correct it. Tomorrow you make the same, you never correct it. After tomorrow you get failed, you become a failure. For that reason, ladies and gentlemen, let's put in our in, in our consideration that nobody has no goal, no aim. For that reason, we need to set a very high goal and we need to achieve them better. Remember the three kinds of 
constructed enemy. Enemies that we have created by, like, uh, I am in this person. I am in action. I can do it. Um, I have done out, I feel rosy, and I want to sleep. Why you want to sleep and you have done no more? You have done nothing. You need not to sleep. Look, it sleeps very much. It sleeps very long time. But after you achieve a very big goal. If you get it, it sleeps as much as you earn. You get it? Eat as you want. So it's just like that. This is what happens. The second natural enemy that we are created by is I am indifferent. Who told you are, you are indifferent? Who told you that you are not successful? Nobody has to. You don't touch my kids. And my instructor called it. If you evaluate yourself and you give yourself a certificate to start and you need to study four years in Khartoum University to get there. You don't need to study in Jackson. You don't need to study out in street. No. You need to come down to be evaluated by people to have this great contribution. Then you can have it. So what's going to happen is you will fail if you say I am indifferent. You are different. Why? Because you have everything. Because you have power, but you need to use it in a very particular way that you set a very particular goal to have them. There are some enemies that we create by our by our hands. What are these enemies we create by our hands? It's like that. Uh, no, no, I got I got enough time. Let me let me do it tomorrow, not now. Put off and call off and postpone and all of these things are enemies we create by ourselves. No, not to post Alia Bukra because you need to do it right now. Come on, guys. It's stop, it's stop what I'm doing. You need to stop. If you don't, uh, if you watch the film, to a when Jack Bauer was speaking to some